You guys, taking photos, cameras, the art of photography is problematic. From the New York Times, the racial bias built into photography. I knew this a long time ago, but I'm glad they're finally reporting on it. Yes, taking pictures is now racist. <laughs> Welcome to Clown World. Happy Wednesday. Welcome to Zeducation Extras. And welcome to another episode of Clown World. Folks, before we get into today's game of You Cringe, You Lose, you know what? I'm changing it right now, on the spot. I'm winging it right now. It's You Cringe, You Win, okay? You Cringe, You Win today. That means your brain works. Before we get into today's game, what are we doing here? What are we doing on another channel? Well, a lot of you have stumbled upon these extras videos and you're wondering, why is there no intro? What is going on here? Maybe a search Zeducation in the top bar and one of those Education Extras videos popped up. This channel is the Overflow channel. If you guys know anything about YouTube or you make videos yourself, then you know the algorithm is a fickle thing. So we're trying to stick to Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday on Zeducation, along with the occasional Wednesday video. But we have much more content that we don't put on that channel. So we decided instead of deleting it, why don't we create another channel and put it all there? So most of the videos that are on this channel they are deleted scenes from old videos. And going forward, if we have any videos like today's video that doesn't really fit in the lineup, the Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday lineup, we're going to put it here on this Education Extras channel for any of you that may need some more work, some more practice in today's clown world. So if you happen to have stumbled upon this channel for the first time, please ask that you subscribe. And if you are here and you previously have watched old videos, please make sure you are subscribed. We have one video for sure a week here plus a lot more coming. With that out of the way, we got to get into today's game. If you are ready for today's game, head down and like this video. And if you are new here, once again, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. If you cringe, you win, go. <sighs> got a protester here, throwing a brick out. <laughs> nice, nice, I love it. You know what? You're already at a protest. You're already an, an annoying activist and you're wearing a mask. I'm going to assume that this is from like the 2020 time frame. There, that's the only thing that makes sense. If this is you in 2024, you, uh, you have some severe problems because you're already making a fool of yourself just being out there in a mask out in the open. And then you have an arm like that and you display it for the whole world to see. Dude, look, I'm not making fun of you. I'm looking out for you. Get off the street, dude. How climate change is hitting vulnerable Indonesian trans sex workers. Nearly 93% of respondents saw decreased income during the rainy season. <sighs> Ooh, welcome to Clown World, <laughs> where everything makes total sense. And they're writing articles like this. If you're cringing already, you win. Congratulations, you win a free subscription to this channel. Make sure you claim it down below. Fatherhood might be bad for your heart, study says. Oh, what a, another study, another stupid result. Don't listen to it. That's a, that's terrible advice. Become a father. It's the best thing ever. It's a lot of work, but it's amazing. U.S. interest payments outstrip defense. A chart here. So we got defense in red, it looks like. All right now, going back to the 50s. that catching up in the 70s wow 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 keep going keep and there it goes we there comes the yeah the iraq afghani wars and keep on keep on it's gonna pass here soon yeah <sighs> i'm not a professional economist but i do know that's not good in your personal life, if you're spending a lot of money on interest, you're losing a lot of money. Denver police say drones will respond to 911 calls instead of cops after city defunded the force by millions. Congrats, Denver. You need uh, the police officer's help. There, you might get a drone. I don't know what they're going to do to stop someone from uh, beating you up or robbing you, but we'll see. I'm single, childless, and alone. Feminism has failed me and my generation, writes Petronola White. Not sure who that is. Oh, is she from, uh, never seen it, but is that The Sopranos, lady? Is that a scene from The Sopranos? I don't know. All I know is that you see these stories pop up quite often 
recently. You do. Feminism, you know, tells you that your career has to come first. You know, having kids, it's not that big of a deal. It's a very big part of life. Don't listen to feminists when they say it's not. Green techs on iPhones, they're ruining relationships. That's right. Non-iPhone users everywhere are being excluded from group texts from sports teams chats to birthday chats to vacation plan chats they're getting cut out missing out on plans and conversations and who's to blame here apple that's just one of the dirty tactics that apple uses to keep a stranglehold on the smartphone market priorities am i right am i right priorities get the green chats gone five-year-old girl left in tears after she's fined 150 pounds by a london council for setting up a lemonade stand just because you're five doesn't mean the law doesn't apply to you effing little pro come on man. i hope that guy's kidding um and congrats city council you guys are doing it you guys are uh creating a future libertarian what do you expect to happen the government up all in your business trying to just trying to sell lemonade a joke yeah, prices here geez two one dollar geez okay so we're almost going up 300 percent mcdonald's one jeez big mac that just slows down a bit double not quite double uh double 108 percent increase jeez you know seeing these prices it's like and then you go and listen to Biden and his his uh, regime, his so-called regime. That's what they say. Um, they're telling you everything's perfect, everything's great, everything's grand, everything's wonderful. What are you talking about? What are you talking? This used to be cheap food. Look, I'm not saying you should go eat this all the time, but come on, man. quit lying. It, we see it every day in the prices. Stop lying to us, you scumbags. Just a girl who missed her 5 a.m. flight and won't make it to her bestie's wedding because Delta sucks. Wait a minute, why is that Delta's fault? And why are you recording yourself crying? But you missed the flight. All <laughs> yeah, Delta that's what I'm saying. Leave on time. Also, if it's your best friend's wedding, don't fly out day of. It's crazy to be like, you are my best friend in the whole world. I will do anything for you, except take a day off and pay for a hotel. <sighs> Dude. He makes a great point. Like, what are you doing flying the day of? You always got a plan. There's weather delays. I mean, the planes aren't going to fly in weather. So if that, they can't control that. Other things, yes, they could control. But, and them leaving on time, yeah, that's not their fault. Stop posting dumb things on social media. McDonald's workers seen drying mop head in fries warmer. What? Ugh. In front of, you did that in front of customers too? Ugh. Why? What? Are you a... You look like you might be... No, you're not a... Looks like the manager is right there. You're either the manager or the manager just walked by you. What are you doing? Oh, never forgets. The dumb ages. We're still in the dumb ages, folks. We are. We saw it in the intro. But never forget, this is what we made kids do. Look at this. Never forget it. Young black kids growing up in the Bronx who don't even know what the word... <laughs> A computer is. They, they don't know. They don't know these things. And I want the world open up to all of them because when you have their di diverse voices innovating solutions through technology, then you're really addressing society's broader challenges. She really said that. I just can't believe it still. We had another clip like this. I think it was on the That Didn't Age Well episode. Dude, at least we got some people that can make fun of this lady. Sadly, you put a D on a glass of water, they'll still vote for it. So she, she's not going anywhere. Whether we like it or not. New York will likely never turn red. It just won't. There's no way. You deserve a treat. And this spring, Mother Nature is providing a seemingly endless supply. Here are some cicada recipes to try. They're really pushing this one. They're really pushing it. No. I'm, no. Not, not eating the bugs. Not doing it. San Francisco buys vodka shots for homeless alcoholics in taxpayer-funded program. I don't think that's the, the solution. You know, maybe, you know, don't par paramedics probably, they have a way to deal with DTs and stuff like that. Someone who's so, so addicted to alcohol that they have withdrawals and they shake. But I don't know if it's vodka. Th 
things will keep getting worse. That's all I know. When my eyes start to burn from staring at medium screen, I give myself a little treat and I stare at little screen. And later, I'll give myself a big old fat reward. The biggest screen of all. The little present at the end of the day for staring at screens. Way to go, Pays. Well, that's uh, it's about as depressing as it gets. Is that, don't we all do that to some degree? Not all of us. I know some of you guys, you guys are cool. You live off the grid, whatever. Some of us have to stare at screens for work, right? And that's, yeah, man, that's a, let's let's cut out. Let's at least cut out the the end of the screen, end of the day screen. Maybe read a book, something like that. You know, let's all agree we can do that. Let's work on it. Eric Adams suggests migrants could fill New York City's lifeguard shortage because, quote, they're excellent swimmers. Dude, what the hell is going on in New York? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there's a few that like grew up competing and swimming, but if you're employed, come on, dude, really? <laughs> Breaking Nancy Pelosi's portfolio has reached new highs. She has made approximately $20 million in the market this year so far. Yeah, killing it. Congrats to Nancy. You know, nothing. L luckily, we have the Stock Act. If she, she trades on insider information, she'll get a little little bit of a fine, like 200 bucks. So that, that'll stop her, of course. Saying the most qualified person should get the job is a microaggression. Britain's top universities insist. That's right. If you are the best at whatever the, the skill is, if you're the best person, you should get the job. But that's a microaggression. That's racist. Don't say that. Romance is white supremacy. Hey, Black studies professor says... <laughs> Next, I'm done. I can't skip it. Skip. skip. I'm stupid. It's insane. Trump reportedly told the oil industry executives this week that he will immediately approve all of their projects and expand drilling should he win in November. More awful things he's promised if he gets a second term. That's awful. Uh, you gotta define your your term "awful," Rolling Stone. That's actually amazing. I hope they. Open up the the black pipelines and just let it pour out into the soil. Let's swim in it and lower the prices. That's what we should do, okay? That's great for the economy. Electric vehicles aren't there yet. They just aren't, so get over yourselves. Google AI said to put glue in pizza, so I made a pizza with glue and ate it. Why? <clears throat> Why? Are you, you guys are strapped for content, Business Insider, or you need some help? Let me know. That's that's ridiculous. That's what a stupid thing. Draymond Green, with his career on court earnings of 177 million, says the NBA is not set up for players to be wealthy after they're done. That is one of the dumbest things I've ever seen. <laughs> Hundred. Hold on, 177 million. Most people won't even make like 2 million in their entire lifetime. 1 to 2 million is like the range where you, that's your total earnings for your whole life. 177 million. Benefit of the doubt, you got half of it chopped because you, you play in California. So let's just say you made 90 million net. Are you insane? Not to mention, dude, you go and like go to the bench players of NBA teams. Those bench players are making like eight to 10 million a year for playing like two minutes a game. It's insane. Out of all the sports where people get paid a lot of money, that is by far the most insane to me. Hillary Clinton blames sexism for 2016 loss. Donald Trump won because he is a man. Good. I feel like there's not much more that gives me pleasure than seeing this old lady still cry about 2016. It's just... Ah, it's so sweet. Cry harder, Hillary. It's so satisfying. Caitlin Clark is popular because she's white and straight. Jamil Hill. Jamil Hill, one of the most one of the most woke idiots on the planet. Um, she's actually popular because she hits threes from the logo. And scores a lot of points. That's why she's popular. There is nothing else entertaining about the WNBA besides Caitlin Clark. Zero things entertaining. That's it. It's, it's a fact. I had to pull over for Taylor. I couldn't keep driving. I saw this and I was like, there's no way this is real. 
but I investigated and I think it's real. Here's the clip muted because we can't play Taylor Swift's music, of course, but there's a Taylor Swift song playing in the background here. If this is you, this is, you're in a cult. You, you can talk to someone, but if you are obsessing over celebrities or, or anyone at all like this, that's not normal. That's not healthy. I encourage you to talk to someone. I'll leave it at that. People on social media have been dragging Chipotle so hard that allegedly a memo was sent out to Chipotle employees instructing them to fill up the bowls as much as possible if someone has their phone out or is filming while ordering. That's the America I know and love. Mm. That's just beautiful. See what we can do together, folks. See what we can do. They're skimping us on the rice and the chicken and the and the beef. Take the phone out. We all do it. And they listen. Let's translate that elsewhere. Let's come on. Let's end on a positive note here. How did you do in today's game? Did you cringe at all? Because if you did, you win. And to congratulate you for winning, you win a free subscription to Z Education Extras. So head down, claim your free subscription. Great deal. Amazing. I know we're trying to be charitable here. We're trying to give back to our, our viewers, you know, so thank you guys for being here. In all seriousness, no, please make sure you subscribe. Uh, it's kind of a, a little bit of a backup to Z Education, and it also helps grow. This is another cast out into the YouTube algorithm. So we got two channels doing that. It's just, it's good for Z Education as a whole. So please subscribe and hopefully you, you want to watch these future videos on this channel. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. I'm Tyler Zed, and this is Education. For the children. Idiots.